What's up, folks? Man, have I got a special for you today. We are headed to Cornfield Crappie Gear to check out the new live sweep, the new electronic ability to turn live scope left, right, doesn't matter, and it still be attached to your trolley motor. Fantastic technology. I cannot wait to learn about it in the C Mark. Stay with me. Please subscribe. This is going to be an awesome episode. We're going to see a lot of cool stuff. Thanks. Get ready for a fantastic episode from Three Pound Fishing. Thanks to these great sponsors. So obviously, one of the cool things about Live Sweep is that it actually maneuvers left to right with either a foot pedal or a key fob which is really unique from the standpoint that I can now maneuver with my trolling motor without it disrupting my view of what live scope should be looking at. And I can do that independently of the trolling motor, which is something I haven't experienced. So this is gonna be new for me, um, but I can tell you, this is definitely the tops in terms of technology and what's available out there. And Cornfield Crappie is right there on the pulse of it, which is really neat. So um, it's gonna be a new experience. We're gonna get to watch it installed. Um, get to talk to Mark about it and some of the other products they've got going on at Cornfield Crappie Gear. So it's going to be an awesome day. I can't wait. It's early in the morning in this beautiful state of Kentucky. Woo! It's going to be a good day. Awesome. Man, I'm excited about this trip. Live Sweep is definitely on the cusp of the newest technology available out there for live scope. And so this is a big trip for three pound fishing. Folks, let me tell you, if you ever get the opportunity, go visit Mark at Cornfield Crappie Gear. It's what? always a great nice. trip. <laughs> All right, so we arrive at Cornfield Crappie Gear. Everybody knows of Mark. You want to introduce us to your, your sidekick again? Our lead man, Nate, over here. He runs all the machines and keeps What's everything up? going. In the shop, dog, we got LaRue. All right, so this is my first look at Live Sweep, and I'm super stoked about it. This is definitely the tops in terms of technology available right now for mounting your Live Scope. This gives you the ability to mount your Live Scope and power it through a foot pedal or a key fob. And as far as I'm aware, it's really not been done anywhere else. I know some other people have been doing things on the side, out of their own garages, but this is something that's gonna be mass produced in a quality shop like Mark has here at Cornfield Crappie Gear. So we're gonna walk you through the installation of it. It's something you can do. So we don't wanna forget go. about, I mean, we're talking about Live Sweep today, but some of the great products that Cornfield Crappie Gear have on top of Live Sweep, which is again is the, the cusp of the technology right now on, on, uh, on crappie fishing, but don't forget the bridge mount right here. How much does this go for? Uh, 99.95. So roughly around 100 bucks for that bridge mount. That's like sturdy. You could tow your boat with that right there. That supports your double mount, your single mount, however you do it, but it raises just enough over that recess. So Mark, tell us why and you developed the, the live sweep and tell us a little bit about the history and how you came up with it. All right, well I was at an ACT tournament in Paris and uh -huh. I seen one of the guys that had added another trolling motor on the side of the trolling motor that he had. Right. He had two foot pedals, one for his trolling motor and one to run the trolling motor that he had the live scope on. Right. He's doing, and we talked about it, he says it worked good but it was killing his back. Right. So I got thinking about it. We talked about it several times, but you know, we'll get busy in here and, and things get kind of put back as we're trying to get things done. Right. And so we come home, we was messing with it, and I kept trying to make something cable steer. I had a little like wheel where he's gonna be able to roll mm -hmm. and all this, and we fooled with it, fooled with it. I couldn't get it to work, and then uh, one of the guys come up with the idea that we needed to just make it an electric motor, and so we started searching all that stuff and, right. and found what we needed. Found a company in the States that's making our board, we got a board here that we can, this is for the remote control, so. Okay. Now where does the board go on the whole the, picture? The, bo is the board, the, the, they're telling me it's waterproof, but I would prefer, I mean, obviously you don't want it on the deck, we're gonna put it underneath somewhere, we're gonna put it in a box. Okay. It's five by five and an inch thick, so it okay. doesn't take up a whole lot of room. Right. And then all you have to do is bring a positive and negative to it. It's pulling about four amps, Okay. so it's, it doesn't take a whole lot. It, the board itself is fused, but we're recommending you put a fuse in the line too, just for the boat safety. And then it'll have, comes with the handheld remote. Okay. 
and then wow that's small so yep. you could actually yeah. probably put this and light and pretty light so maybe a hand you could do something on a wrist you could have a, yep. something yep. that support it or okay. if you're if you're running your remote control motor and you got the lanyard for that you Just can put add right that here. on there and you never know it's there awesome. well then we have a set of pedals that are wired up and we're working, looking at going to the wireless pedals. Okay. So that's, that, that may just be the way we go. The guides are kind of wanting, you know, nobody wants more wires on the deck. Right. And the guides are wanting it, like it'd be good for you to put it behind your customers and then you could step on that anywhere in the boat and run your motor and have your customers up front. And That's nice. Nice and small, I like it, small and compact. And still then take we worked with the electrical engineer on how we were going to wire this and all that, and we wanted to make it so that it was super easy. Right. When you all you bring you bring your power to this board, and then all you have to do is plug this in here. The pedals plug into the other one. That's right. it. It'll all be married together. It's going to be turned in the right direction. We bench test every one of them before they go out. When we wire them up, we check them to make sure they're right. Send them on their way. Okay. So a lot of people are going to be wondering about how is it mounted on the shaft. What's supporting it, and how far is it sticking? What is it going to affect your boat cover? Or, well, we're going to have we got a mount that'll go on either side, and we'll we'll mount it up here in a little bit, and then we'll show you how that that's going to work. Okay, cool. And we'll see because we tried to make as much adjustment as we could because everybody's boat set up different. Right. You know, some guys got a cover, some guys don't. Your units might be in the way on the on the inside. Your cover may be in the way on the outside. So we got a lot of adjustment in. We also built in some up and down adjustment because deeper boats, longer shafts, all this and that. Okay. And if somebody needs like a, for a 75 inch motor or something, they can call and talk to me and we can custom build one for 75, that's no big deal. That's what you love about cornfield crappy gear. Custom. So and, let me. And uh, the live scope itself, the factory brackets that come with the live scope mount onto our poles. So okay. there's no, you don't need anything special or anything like that. So one of the great things about Live Sweep is that you yourself can actually install it. It's not hard, it's not difficult. So we're actually gonna walk you through this whole process and how it's actually installed, right? Yep, yeah. we'll, we'll put it on here and I'll show you piece by piece what we're doing, why we're doing, and, and, and as always, you can always give me a call. I answer the phone pretty much all the time. But. <laughs> right, and you can also get your local marina to install it as oh, well. Yeah. But what we want you to leave with is that you can actually install this yourself and that's the important thing. That's it's why we tried to make it as plug and play as we could so it's going to be easy. Perfect. Awesome. All right, very important message that you can install this yourself, folks. The quality of each one of these components is extremely high. The attachment to the Ultrex, the foot pedal, the key fob. The key fob is amazingly light. Everything down to the actual unit itself is high quality. Yeah, we're going to take just take the old one off the shaft. This, again, this is the factory bracket, so we're going to take the factory bracket off, and then it'll mount onto our our tube on our pipe there, so we're on the sweep. You need nothing extra; just what comes with it will mount right on the live sweep. So we're built. We're building our own brackets. We machine these ourselves, and we have a right and a left, so you can put it on either side of the all tracks. Whichever way it needs to go. Here, this is going to get in the way of your unit, so we're going to have to put it on this side. So this is what you love about Cornfield Crappy Gear is they actually make attachments for all the different types of trolling motors that you might have. And if you have something that's special, they will actually custom make it to make sure that Live Sweep works for you. So Mark's a great dude. He'll actually answer the phone like you said earlier in the episode, and uh, he'll help solve the problem, or he'll come up with an answer with the pro for the problem. We got the clamp. All right, so we got, this is our, our bracket that mounts onto the Altrex, and now we have a two-piece clamp with two screws in it here. This will clamp onto this, this clamps onto this. The reason we've done this is now this will give you some rotation around here to help adjust it. And Yeah, there you go, rotates up and around or down, whatever you might need for your, your particular setup. And then this also gives you rotation if you need it, but it's going to give you adjustment this way. So we're going to set it up so we got just a little bit of room between the prop and the bottom of the pole. We'll put the live scope transducer about right here so you're up high enough so when the motor swings around it's going to miss it. So we, we kind of tried to add in as much adjustment as we can for each individual setup. So we actually have a hole in here 
and we got we'll send a little piece of hose our, our hose for our regular live scope mount and this will go in here with just a little bit of a loop in it so that'll turn but that keeps the hose managed the, the cable managed so it's not flopping we gotcha. got we'll do that when we stand it up that's, that's my motto All right, let's go down a little bit to about right there. And that's, I want that. That'll be in the instructions. That needs to be as high up as possible. Cable management. Cable management? Yep. Is that with that plastic? A piece of tape on it right here just to keep it from being flopped and loose and didn't get yep. caught on something. But we got to have a little loose here so it'll rotate. That's why we have stops, uh, switches in it so it only goes so far then stops and then it goes back the other way. It doesn't go continue around and around and around because you'll wind up the cable okay when you do the installation the box itself here the, the lid the cover the whole unit needs to be facing straight forward of the boat because you've only got so many degrees one way and so many degrees the other way so this you want this because it depends how your trolling motor set up if your trolling motors on an angle like this one then you need the box going straight forward okay that gives you the, the maximum amount of sweep in both directions so I'm telling you what folks, this install is going very quickly. Let me remind you too about Cornfield Crappie Gear. These folks have high quality, big time machinery, CNC machines, everything you can imagine. The quality is there and so is the uh, quantity. Folks, rarely are you gonna run into an issue in terms of inventory and they have it all there. Let me tell you, it's really great to listen and talk to Mark about all the new stuff that's coming out of Cornfield Crappie Gear. And let me tell you, just some high quality, and great people that work at this organization. All right, so there you go. That's a that's an install. Very easy. The only thing you're going to have maybe finding an electrical source. That's the big option or big thing you're going to have to figure out where your electrical source is. Other than that, mechanically putting it on the boat is easy. Easy. So the key fob right there. It's always on. And that clears it. Clears it so you don't have to worry about what side the live scope's actually on or where it's at. So that's nice too. Wow. Sturdy construct too, man. That is heavy. Heavy duty. Heavy duty built, man. That's awesome. All right, we just got done with live sweep. The install is there. The remote scope, as they like to call it. The guys are coming up. Come on, Rube. And I'll tell you what, it was a great day at Cornfield Crappie Gear installing the new live sweep that is an awesome new technology what do you think good time yeah awesome man great time, getting ready man. to test it out yeah see what you come up with so we're looking forward to using a three pound fishing uh i'm going to bring you guys along for the ride it's gonna be a great experience and of course you're always gonna know where to get it at. It's gonna be cornfield crappie gear my man mark nate it's gonna be a good good experience so hey mark if you need to get one of these live sweeps what do they need to do to get one you can give us a call at 217-304-1680 or www.cornfieldcroppygear.com perfect awesome cool all right i just got out in the water with the new live sweep from cornfield crappie gear i wanted to show it to you guys hey uh this is incredible i'm i'm facing a certain particular way live scope's going the other way it's pretty cool stuff but uh definitely a new experience awesome awesome experience Thanks for watching another 3-Pound Fishing episode sponsored by these great companies.